Hello everyone, welcome to my video. Today in this video we will be working with this model. It's a nice polygonal base. It will be nice to model it together. Firstly, we are creating a sketch in font plane as always we do. I will start here with some group of lines. And now convert all of them to construction geometry. Then place my dimensions. I do have a 75 there, 20 there, and a 40 here. Now the second step is placing my spline. Later on, I play with my spline control points, clicking control, and clicking this uh, construction geometry, also control point, and saying parallel. Maybe if you notice, if you watch my other videos, I also have this habit creating here a construction geometry and then making them tangent. These both make same, make same, it's just preference. Here I have 100. Here I do have 75. And I do have an angle of 65. Now I can convert this construction geometry. I think I made wrongly line again. And after this operation, we see OK. And surfaces, revolve surface. Here, mid plane will be open. Axis of revolution here. And we have a 30 degree. After this operation, we will close our surface revolve and go to loft. Select this edge and this edge, and then create here a straight connection. Then we can hide original surface. Now we select our origin and top plane and create here an axis. After this operation, I will make circular pattern. 12 instances will be there and bodies will be active. Then I do have my model. We are going to create planar surface. Probably I have different habit. I knit body and then selecting surfaces in one time. I will show what I mean. For example, if you click right click here, say loop open loop you see that this uh, empty area will not be selected but if you make that surface and here coming and saying open loop you will be having all the edges and then you can select planar surface and knit it again and I do find it always easy now I will look my model. I will open in the front plane a new sketch and convert the first initial sketch and offset of 5 and I do convert this to construction geometry in the middle and just combine these points. We will just make here revolve cut here we have radius 2, we can add it. Here we have a chamfer, we look normal too. I hit here a circle and then click control, selecting my circle and line, say tangent, it's fully black. Extrude cut. With angle, but the flip side to cut will make a nice chamfer over there for us. And now we can add nice fillets. Fillet radius will be 5. And by this selection pop up menu, you can select the relevant ones. After this operation, we are going to create a sketch. 
offset of five and cutting 1.5 with 45 degree and I will select with the same method now the third one probably this one first one five now we will say here it is three after if you can click enter you will have the last comment again and i added one more radius and i do click again fill it same comment is there i have here a five radius then we will have this nice look in fact by now we completed more lighting if you change your display states activate perspective and real view and define some material yeah it will look nice that was it i think it's quite simple for you guys thank you for watching if you like my video please do make comment and hit the like button it's appreciated see you in another video